In mainstream physics, there is no logical reason why two fundamentally different properties, like space and time, should be linked together in a peculiar 3 plus 1 dimensional form. This theory explains this by simple geometry based on a process of spherical symmetry forming and breaking. An interior of a sphere is naturally three-dimensional, with a spherical surface forming an extra dimension that we comprehend and measure as time. The two-dimensional surface of the sphere also forms a boundary condition, or manifold, for positive and negative charge. Because the process is relative to the spherical surface, we have to square the radius. This can be seen in the equations of physics, with the speed of light squared, the electron squared, and the wave function squared. The geometrical aspect of this process is based on Huygens' principle that says every point on a light wave front has the potential for a new spherical light wave. We can think of every point as a potential for a photon-electron interaction or coupling. The interior of the sphere naturally forms our three-dimensional space. The spherical surface forms a boundary condition or manifold for positive and negative charge as the future unfolds with the exchange of quantized energy. In this theory, the light photon and electron are two aspects of the same process. They are not properties of space and time. They form the characteristics of three-dimensional space with one variable in the form of time. Light and matter in the form of electrons moves as waves with particle characteristics as a probabilistic future comes into existence, quanter by quanter, moment by moment.